Hey YouTube! Um, today I'm going to do a video on the iPod Touch. And it's actually kind of weird because I never done a video on the iPod Touch. And actually a year ago I did two videos for the guitar. And if you want you can go check those out. Um, my channel is JJ Georgie. Just subscribe to me. You can rate my videos, comment on them. And today I'm going to do a video on the iPod Touch. My version is a 3.1.2. Uh, and I don't know if these glitches or anything work on anything higher than 3.0 or, uh, or lower than 3.0 software. But, oh well, you better share it out. But um, anyways, I'm going to show you some tips and tricks too. And let's get started here. So, this is my eye touch. Yep, and it's actually kind of funny. I have an iPhone case on this, but anyways. So, you're going to need a password for this, or for um, a couple of these glitches. So, if you don't know how to get a password, all you have to do is go to your general, first your settings, and then go to your general, and then you go to your passcode lock and your auto lock and you make a password over there. But okay, so this is how you do the first glitch. So you slide over here obviously and so you type in the first or you touch the first three digits of your code and then on the last digit you hit your last digit and then hit your power button at the same time like this and it'll do that and as you can see there's like a lock screen on the top show you which actually isn't supposed to be there because there's actually supposed to be the time there let's say you want to open up an app like a calendar it'll become white you might not be able to see that it's white but it's white there and the lock screen but to fix this all you have to do is go back and just type in your code normally and see now you can see the time okay now the next thing the next glitch i'm going to show you follows like the same concept you just type in the first three digits but this time what you have to do is type in the last digit and then hit your power button really fast like this oh sorry And it'll come back like that. So what you have to do is slide. All right, first three digits. Then right after you hit your last digit, you hit the power button like this. See, and it'll go back. So that's another glitch. And now I'll show you a little trick here or a tip. Um, a lot of you may already know this, but yeah, if you don't, here you go. Um, you touch your home button and your power button at the same time like this and it'll take a picture of your screen all you have to do is go to your photos save photos then as you can see here that's a picture that we just took and so that's something kind of cool and I think you can do this on any software I'm not sure but okay and then another glitch you can do I just figured this out I actually haven't seen this one on YouTube I don't know um, but here we go. I don't know what software, but here. All you have to do is hit your home button, and then, like, put your finger down, slide, and then it'll go back to that same page like this. See? So, I'll show you again. Hit your home button like this. Put your finger down, slide, and it'll just come back to the same page. You can do this practically on any page, I think, but, um... Uh, I just like doing it on the last page. I don't know why. I think it's easier. But um, I have a lot of pages. But okay. Now, um, oh yeah. And a tip you can do here is um, if you don't want to, if you're too lazy to hit the music button and you want it really fast, all you have to do is double click your home button and it'll go to your music. And let's say, play this. Okay. And then if you double click now, it'll come here, and you can just pause it, do whatever you want. You can skip that song, skip it, whatever, do whatever you want. And um, 
you can close it, go back to your music, or, yeah. So, and, um, I guess that's all for today. Like I said, just rate, subscribe, comment. Um, I'm sorry if this video was bad quality. If it was, sorry, but, um, it's my first video, so <laughs> you just got to bear with me. <laughs> but, uh, that's it for today. I'll make sure I put some more guitar videos and some more iTouch videos and app reviews on here. And thank you for watching. Bye.